Now to get started on what a domain controller actually is, the easiest way to explain this is it's just a computer. Let's name it domain controller here with an operating system on it. Um, in our case, we will be labbing with a Windows uh, Server 2019 operating system. And for every time you join a device, say a PC, we'll just name them all PCs here. PC1, PC2, and PC3. And what really happens is you join these devices to your domain controller and it'll start populating different computers here as objects. And what that allows you to do is authenticate to the domain controller if you have any policies in place. The same thing would happen for users. You would create a user here. Let's say we make three users and each user can sign into the computers with their usernames. And of course you use the domain controller 